According to a UNM police report, a 19-year-old female student claimed she was raped and held against her will in a room at Lobo Village. We've learned the man accused in this case is a UNM Lobo football player. The report states the female student came forward last month and told investigators it started with text messages from her ex-boyfriend. We're not naming him since charges have not been filed. The 19-year-old says her ex invited her to his dorm in February to watch a movie and asked her for sex. The woman claims she told him no sex but did agree to a movie. After the movie, she claims the 21-year-old football player grabbed her, saying, quote, don't fight it, I'm stronger than you are. She says he then proceeded to rape her and held a pillow over her mouth when she tried to scream. The next day, she says he sent her a text that he was sorry for what he did and asked that she not respond. When police interviewed the suspect, he changed his story. According to the report, the Lobo player first claimed he and his ex did not have sex that night. It wasn't until investigators confronted him with his own text messages that police say he admitted to having sex with the 19-year-old while she, quote, repeated several times, no, and stop. The player accused of rape and kidnapping also told police the woman was kissing him as she was telling him no and to stop. Once the case is completed, it will be sent to the DA's office. We, of course, reached out to UNM police and the UNM athletic department. Neither department would comment tonight. Back to you. All right, thank you, Gabrielle. The Department of Justice did their own investigation about how the university handles sexual assault cases after getting a series of complaints from students. You may also recall a high profile case in 2014 when three men, two of them Lobo football players at the time, were accused of raping a freshman after a party. Charges were later dropped. Attorneys on both sides said UNM botched the investigation.